China has been building multiple dams on all the rivers that originate from Tibet. Uh, some 32 dams on the Mekong alone before it enters the third country. So this big project of China uh, at the Great Bend, at what is called the Great Bend of Brahmaputra, where the Bra Brahmaputra flows from Western Tibet to Eastern Tibet, and then takes a U-turn to come into India, into Arunachal Assam and all that. So they are building a dam which is considered three times the size of Three Gorges Dam, which is the biggest in the world today. And uh, the whole uh, Himalayas came because of the uh, uh, collision of uh, Asian plate and the Gondwana plate, and some scientists still say it's growing. The, Himal Himal the Himalayas are still growing, and these are all seismic zones. Uh, irrespective of the size of the uh, earthquakes or uh, natural disasters. But if something has to happen to that size of a river, uh, to the dam, then what could be the consequences on India, on Assam, uh, and in Bangladesh? So these are something very serious. These are very serious issues which need to be considered by the, all the riparian countries. Not just We are not just talking about Brahmaputra. We are talking about... Uh, from Satlesh to, you know, to the origin of the Ganga is also on the border between Tibet and India, then into the rivers that flows into Irrawaddy and um, Mekong, and those flows into Laos, Cambodia, Thailand, Vietnam, all these countries, and the two major rivers into China also flow, originate from Tibet. So Tibet, because of the altitude of Tibet, which now people call as the third pole, because it has the largest amount of glaciers and permafrost that feeds all these 10 major rivers in, that goes into 10 different countries in the Asian subcontinent.